Hello and welcome back. In today's video I am sharing my fall evening routine with you. Certain parts of my evening routine change depending on the season. However, I do have some general things to do each evening no matter what day of the week. The first one is making dinner. I like to have dinner on the table between 5.30 and 6 most nights. Tonight we are having some sourdough dinner rolls and a creamy mushroom soup with herbs. Both recipes I will link for you in the description box below. With the nights cooling off, I can finally turn on the oven again and enjoy the windows open. Cooking is my favorite homemaking task. I try my best to have fresh ingredients in the fridge at all times and an idea of what I want to make. In this way I can avoid the stress of not knowing what to make and instead focus on my time in the kitchen creating it. Often this is easier said than done.
After dinner is finished, I always clean the table and the kitchen for the night. This is one of the most important things I do in my night routine, no matter what time of year. It sets the tone for the next day since it allows me to start each day with a freshly cleaned kitchen. Having this one thing as part of my evening routine to do no matter what else happens has helped me to be more efficient as a homemaker. Each time I clean my cast iron skillets, I pat them dry and rub them down well with oil. Lately I have been using beef tallow and this has worked amazingly well to keep them non-stick. Once the kitchen is cleaned, I sort of begin straightening up anything that needs to be put right in our house, and often that is the living room since this is our main living space. And I have to tell you that these drop cloth no sew couch covers that I made have held up nicely, and I'll link the tutorial above where I showed how I did this. It's been a great alternative to buying a new couch for sure. After everything is cleaned up, it's time to make a cup of tea. I have been enjoying green tea in the evening, and since it's after dinner, I don't put anything in my tea as I do intermittent fasting.
During this time of year, something I like to do is sit down and reflect on the day of what got done along with anything that didn't. I write a list for each day that I can start with in the morning. And the first is usually anything that spilled over from the day before. This includes things for my daughter, our household, her schooling, the blog, and YouTube. Everything goes on the list. I like to leave the page open to the list on my desk where I begin each morning. I began recently attempting to read through the entire Bible, something I've tried before, but I found this list online for reading through the Bible in one year by doing just 15 minutes a day, and so far it's made this much more doable, and I like that it gives me direction on where to start. So since the start of school, this is something I'm doing as part of my evening routine. I do my skincare routine before winding down and relaxing completely. I like to do oil washing for my face wash and if you are interested in a great natural skincare routine, I will share my natural skincare routine video with you below. I'm going to refill my tea and make hot cocoa for my daughter. I use milk, cocoa powder, a little vanilla, and honey for the hot cocoa. Each night I like to try to spend some extra time with my daughter. Sometimes we play a game, just sit and talk or read. Tonight she's asked me to watch a movie. We love to watch old movies together and since it's fall and Halloween is coming up we are going to go through the Alfred Hitchcock movies. Tonight it's Rear Window. Thank you so much for being here. I hope you've enjoyed today's fall night routine video. Have a wonderful week ahead and I will see you next week.